Hi folks, so this is the last video I'll do before Christmas. Um, and what I'm going to do is just show a very simple um, packaging idea. Uh, of course, I'm going just plain with the inside stuff because I thought um, that doesn't matter so much because what you put inside your box is going to be totally different. So, um, what I'm putting inside my boxes is these watches that I made. Um, for some friends. And if you want to see the pattern on how to do this, go to um, Off the Beaded Path, I think it is. She's the one who showed me how to do this um, with her videos. I don't know if you can see that. So I followed her instructions pretty closely, except for how I attached it here. Um, but I'm putting it inside a little bag. And I did not follow her directions very closely for this one. But you can kind of get the idea that it's similar. Anyway, so then um, what I did is I got these little boxes. They're half inch thick boxes by, I think it's a six by four or five and a half by four and a half, something like that uh, box and they're nice and clear and they're crystal clear. They're really, really nice. So I'll just assemble the boxes. Like this. And I'll just wrap these with tissue paper. Just let you guys get the idea of what I'm doing here. Okay, tissue paper. Well, whatever you're going to put in there. Slide it in. Okay. Alright, so I should have done that off camera, but oh well. Okay, so we've got that put in there. I can't see what it is. Then I got this paper um, from Michael's. It's the Recollections uh, Holiday Glitzy Glitter paper. Um, I got that and I used a couple of the. They've got all kinds of different shiny sheets and okay. I. Got all kinds of different shiny, shiny sheets. Shiny, shiny. Um, so, I'm, what else did they? I got this for like 70 cents, something like that, because I had coupons and all kinds of stuff. And it's just borders. And I thought I could use those borders. And then I got another pack of something. I got this, the Can Company. Um, no, what is this called? K and Company Christmas die cut cardstock and acetate. And we got acetate here and then cardstock here. Some of them are glittery, some of them are plain, some of them are big, some small, some kind of creepy. Um. Anyway, I I don't like dolls. Dolls kind of wig me out a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the box, I'm going to create like a belly band for the box using the paper. And I'm just going to go really, really simple because these are small gifts. Um, this piece of paper is 12 by um, it's 12 by 2. This paper here is 8.5 by 1.5. And, and I'm not really caring as long as it's similar in size there. And then this will be taken care of when I'm at the end. Take it, decide on your front and back. I think that's the 
the back. This is the front. So I'm going to wrap it around. Just pinch it with your fingers a little bit, just enough to hold it. Then take the snot out of that. There you go. This isn't going to need a whole lot of anything at all just because it's really thin. It's vellum. And I'm going to... And they're just going to tear it off probably or leave it on. So I don't know. So I'm not really all that worried about how it... how it looks. But I do want it straight and I do want it sort of centered. I'm not worried about the back too much. I just want to be sure that it's adhered well. And then I'm going to put this die cut here, popped up as much as I can. And it's a very simple way to use up some die cuts that you may not um, have found uses for and it uses up some of the borders and a little bit of leftover whoops, babysitting a dog um, leftover um, Christmas paper and it's a very easy and fun and it gives a nice uh, impact when you hand over the gift instead of it being just in that little bitty there you go and instead of it being that um, they're going to get this so they get to unwrap and they get to you know have a little bit of decoration too uses like I said it uses up some leftover part and uh, leftover pieces that I had and decorative. So, um, watch uh, my videos coming this January because there will be a surprise there. Um, I'll let you go for now. Talk to you later. Bye.